In this video session, we're gonna discuss about one of the most important insect pests of agricultural crops in the Asian tropic region. So the name of the pest is Spodoptera litura. It is also known as Tyro caterpillar. And if we talk about the common name of Spodoptera, then the common names are tobacco cutworm or cotton leaf worm. First of all, let us begin with the classification of Spodoptera litura. It belongs to class Insecta, order Lepidoptera family Nocotidae, genus Spodoptera, and species S. Litera. If we talk about the host of Spodoptera, then the host plant are cotton, tobacco, and other cash crops. So before heading towards the life cycle of Spodoptera litera, let us learn some characteristic features of Spodoptera. So Spodoptera litera feeds on leaves, leaving its skeletal parts only. It parasites the plant through larval vigorous eating pattern. As I have already mentioned that Spodoptera litera is most common in South Asian region, it is distributed in tropical and temperate Asia. It causes heavy damage of cotton and tobacco plant. It lowers the production of these plants. However, the damage in the plant is caused by worm-like young larva. Now let us discuss about life cycle of Spodoptera litera. It completes tubal generation every year. Each generation lasts about one month, in winter, slightly more than one month, whereas in summer, slightly less than one month. Life cycle is completed as egg, larva, pupa, and adult. The first phase of life of Spodoptera is egg. So female lays about 2000 to 2600 eggs during her lifetime. Eggs are laid on the clusters on the surface of the leaf. Eggs clusters are covered with the hair of golden brown color. Shape of egg is spherical, slightly flattened, orange-brown to pink in color. And the second phase in the life cycle of Spodoptera litera is the larval phase, which lasts for about 16 days. So Spodoptera goes through 6 instar phase of larva. Larva are about 2.3 to 3.2 mm in length. The young larva is light green and usually translucent, whereas the old larva is dark brown in color. During daytime, larva can be found in the swell. A bright yellow stripe along with the dorsal surface of the larva is the characteristic features of larva. The larva is the feeding stage. It feeds on leaves, flowers, and fruits. The third phase of life of Spodoptera litera is the pupal phase. When larva burrows into soil several centimeters, then it goes into the resting phase called pupa. It is red to brown in color and takes place for 7 to 10 days. And the characteristic features of the pupal phase of Spodoptera litera is the presence of spine at the tip of the abdomen. And the final phase in the life cycle of Spodoptera litera is the adult phase. Adult is gray brown in color, 15 to 20 mm in length. Male survive for 10.4 days whereas female, they survive for 8.3 days. Now let us discuss about the damage caused by Spodoptera litera in cotton and tobacco plant. In cotton, leaves develop irregular brownish red patches and the stem base may be cut off. And on tobacco plant, the larva feeds on leaves, leaving the skeletal parts only. So you might have a question that how can we control this important insect pest? Spodoptera litera are more serious pests. The use of entomopathogenic nematodes EPN as a biological control agent are more effective for Spodoptera litera. 